Hey guys, Vlad here from Words of Scale. So, not many people know this, but my primary area of expertise is marketing. I've been in marketing for 20 years now, and today I want to talk about Reddit marketing and how you can implement it to get traffic to your SaaS business, your affiliate offer, your pages, whatever it may be. And I'll be giving away two free tools. There is not gonna be a paywall. And if you appreciate stuff like that, please give me a like and give me a comment. I'll be using that as a feedback loop to make sure that this type of content is valuable to you. With that being said, let's uh, take a step back and talk about why Reddit marketing is important. So in my opinion, 2025 is the year of Reddit. And no, I'm not talking about the Google using Reddit results. So research shows that 73% of growth in brand engagement is achieved through Reddit versus the traditional social media tools. The acquisition cost is extremely low. The conversion rate is higher just because of the high concentration of loyal audience. There are niche audiences actively seeking solutions. There are high intent users with purchasing power. It's less saturated than traditional platforms and there is a subreddit virtually for everything. And these are some of the case studies that I've found. One of the case studies is pretty recent, 2024. The company name is Dropbox. So basically they hosted 47 AMAs, which stands for Ask Me Anything Sessions, primarily inside of the R forward slash productivity subreddit and what they did is very near and dear to me so i believe in this strategy wholeheartedly they identify 15 micro subreddits built relationships with moderators contributed valuable content for three months and established thought leadership that was phase one and phase two was value first approach created free productivity templates hosted weekly productivity wednesdays shared behind the scenes development insights and responded to every comment within two hours and as a result, they boosted their user acquisition by almost 300%. Case number two is Purple Mattress, again from 2024. This time they were targeting the mildly interesting subreddit. The original post said this mattress has a gel grid instead of springs or foam. And that worked because it sparked curiosity. So the hook was curiosity driven, the engagement was sensational. And this resulted in a 23% uptake in the conversion rate and uh, over two million dollars in revenue generated. Finally, a notion case. They were again employing the micro subreddit uh, conquest strategy. So they were targeting a few of the micro subreddits. I wouldn't call them micro, but still what they did, uh, they created over 120 free templates targeting specific use cases within micro communities and average template generated 81 qualified leads and they got 150 percent plus as far as template downloads so naturally we'll be talking about finding high value micro subreddits and it's not as easy as it seems and our workflow will stem from different resources uh, the first resource is called redditroy.com this is the site that i created and it basically helps you discover high roi subreddits for your SaaS business but this is built off of a keyword so if you have a keyword in question let's say you're into a SEO. This will search micro subreddits and there is a uh, backend logic that shows you relevance ROI score. The uh, more niche the subreddit and the more active the subreddit, the higher ROI is being assigned to. It does take some time. Yeah, but this was very fast. Now, this too is not perfect. So sometimes if there is a subreddit that has SEO in either the name or the description and it has nothing to do with search engine optimization, it will show up here. But I would say like 8 out of 10 times this is very relevant. So you can scroll down, you can go, you can visit this particular subreddit and this one is R SEO 2 reviews. You get average daily posts, monthly grow, the ROI score and the relevance. Now we have SEO digital marketing, SEO experts, SEO marketing offers, SEO infographics, SEO growth, SEO SaaS. You can go all the way down, click on show more, and basically expand everything. What I would do, I would just read through this list and take a note of the subreddits that I feel contained my target audience. Let's just say these are these four. Then you click on save selected and go to the saved 
subreddits tab. Now you can export the CSV with these subreddits and use them to your own discretion for your own purposes. Or you can go to project information, fill this in. So say words at scale school community for the project description let's just choose our product description so we are creating multimedia articles one click directories everybody is happy people are getting results so let's just paste this in and for the target audience let's say seos and beginner bloggers our goals and objectives uh, paid school descriptions that lead to and let's just make sure we have the link here so now it's going to take all these subreddits read the descriptions and write you a personalized marketing plan for 30 days that you can use so now it says the marketing plan created you go to the marketing tab and this is in markdown you can export you can copy let's just copy for now and this is your third day plan. This plan focuses on building a presence and driving traffic to the worst scale school community using a value driven approach. Subreddit strategy, subreddit name, strategy, best content types. This is invaluable. Then content calendar, day one. And this has the day and the corresponding subreddit and what you need to do like day one our seo tool reviews this is a subreddit you need to post the question what is the most underrated seo tool you're using right now and why and the purpose of this post is to generate discussion learn about new tools and potentially identify areas where worse scale tools could stand out and this is a very robust 30-day plan it gives you a list of best practices like building community relationships first providing genuine value, following subreddit rules, engaging authentically. And now the content type, types to use. You have your AMAs, help posts, questions, resource sharing, and pain points addressing. And I think one of the more powerful ones is the ask me anything, especially if you can attempt it or tackle it from a standpoint of real authority. So another resource that I've created is uh, here what's the scale rated AMA post creator and it has some pre-built templates this is nothing fancy no AI <laughs> uh, you choose your persona either a professional or industry expert personal experience let's just say this is me and this is fully fully editable and you can preview your AMA here it gives you a template I'm your job title at Company Industry, Hi Reddit. I've been working as a job title for X years at company, uh, at a specific company in my role. And brief description of what you do. Some interesting aspects of my work include, I've seen a lot of questions about relevant topic lately, so I thought this would be a great opportunity to share insights from someone working in the field. Ask, ask me anything about your industry profession. I'll be here for the next few hours answering questions about career paths, daily work life, industry trends, or anything else you're curious about. And you, you paste it in. And you do that regularly uh, every week. Uh, of course, you would want to mix it up with other types of content, like the help posts regularly, to address common SEO and digital marketing challenges like questions, to spark discussions and understand the audience pain points like resource sharing, provide value and establish credibility. This ties back to into the templates that we discussed uh, in the beginning as being one of the success cases and stuff like that. So to recap, you need to have your keywords in mind. You go to this tool, which is redditroy.com. You insert it here, no sign up required. You get a list of subreddits, you save the subreddits, you insert your project information, nothing is stored. So if you refresh the browser, it's going to disappear. And then you generate your marketing plan, which you can copy. And for one of the more powerful formats, which is AMA, you can use this Reddit AMA post creator. And the idea is here is to provide value and then try and promote your product. Again, this could be used for a, if you're a small to medium business, this could be used if you're a SaaS business, this could be used if you're an affiliate marketer, a content creator even, and this is extremely powerful. If you like this, 
give me a like and a comment. Also, I will be increasing the price of my school community soon. People are doing amazing things just from today. This is an interactive story one of my students created using our one-click prompt. And this has audio and music and everything. Another one of our students created this amazing cinematic immersive web page. Again, a one-click creation that was not possible before. And if you want to be the 1% of 1% of people who are doing this, go check out my school community and I'll see you there. Cheers.